Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the. Knock, Living knock. Room. What? Um, knock, Who's knock. there? What? <laughs> what? What are you talking about? <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? Stranger Things. Let's go. Oh, you don't want me to do an intro? <laughs> All right, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. She's ready. Hey, in a previous intro, you were talking about the Marta. Yeah, I was. That ain't what our Marta was. Like. <laughs> <laughs> What if it was a time machine? This is off of me. <laughs> I think they just went down. <laughs> I think it was an elevator. Is everyone okay? Don't yeah, act I'm like great. that's surprising. This show is crazy. You can't design elevators. Same as the loading dock door. If we don't have a key card, it won't operate. Meaning we're stuck in here. Yeah. I'm supposed to be spending the night at Tina's, and Tina <laughs> always covers for me. But if I'm not home for Uncle Jack's party tomorrow, you're throw. I don't <laughs> care about Tina or Uncle Jack's party. Your mom's not gonna be able to find us if we're dead in a Russian elevator. <laughs> what if we climbed out? I love Dustin's shirt right now. <laughs> What does it say? It's a cow sunbathing and it says roast beef. <laughs> <laughs> what were you saying about climbing? Well, they look screwed, don't they? That's like that Disney ride where you drop all them floors. Growing up, I didn't go to Disney World. <laughs> <laughs> it's like somebody's home. We didn't have TV till I was 16. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if you can buy Hopper's shirt. That'd be yeah, tough if I you had should that. get it. You should get it. That's what we should be for Halloween, Joyce and Hopper. <laughs> I gotta put on some weight. Just I gotta put on bit. a wig. Not too much. And I gotta start working on growing a mustache. No, we can put. And one I'm on too late. You. Maybe next year we can do it. Where's it coming from? It's below us. Joyce, you smart as hell. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. She does not need to be at that store. Yeah, she's way too detective worthy. <gasps> We should have known with the one coffee cup and the cigarette butts. Hey, dipshit! Hawkins PD, hands in the air. <laughs> Don't Bro, they are make way me too Russian to surrender. Again. Что американская полиция? English. You speak English? Пожалуйста, сэр, опустите пистолет. Мы не хотим. No, understand. Hopper. I only know one Russian word. And what is that? Shiza. What does that mean? That's German. Oops. <laughs> I was, man, he drug me into that. Don't move! Drop the gun. Drop the weapon! A what? Or what? You what? to shoot. Good. Put one in his knee, Hopper. You wouldn't do that. Why is that? Because you're a policeman. Not down here, brother. You test that theory? I'm gonna count to three. One, two, three! I knew he was gonna do that. S separate yourself next time, Hopper. <laughs> <laughs> Poor fella. Come on, Hopper, Joyce is watching. Hopper! <laughs> Dang, man. <laughs> Damn, that was funny. Come on, swing it off. We practice for those moments. Go, 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 go! Maybe, I don't know. At the pool the other day, you were wild. <laughs> Joyce, drive! Come on, Joyce, quit throwing around! <laughs> He's stressing me out. It's like Fortnite. <laughs> That's the little bot that just keeps shooting. Hey, she dodged every bullet. Still think it was our government? 
<laughs> it's the pose for me. He came out of the house. So obviously the Russians and Hawkins lab are tied. I mean, obviously, but I don't know. We just need to get deeper into this, man. I'm ready for the whole the whole conspiracy to start opening up. You know what I mean? Yeah. They're cloaking the show in a lot of mystery right now. Yeah, because the Russians are near the mall. The Russians are tied to the lab somehow. The Russians have that green thing. Billy, though, I don't. Billy's the curveball, right? Because I don't think the Russians know about him. Mm, yeah, I guess they don't. Phone call, phone call. Phone call, phone call. Pokemon, <laughs> did you get that? No. Hello. Jonathan, I'm at the hospital with Driscoll. What? I need you to put me on the phone with your brother. Uh, Why wouldn't he be safe? Do you know Magnet? 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 Yes, yes Magnet. <laughs> do you magnetize? Stop working. I, I, do you understand? Guys, please! You give me a headache, both of you. <laughs> what have you learned, huh? You learned that Smirnoff over there. He calls them Smirnoff. Smirnoff is Russian and works for Starcourt. Two uh, things we already knew. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah. Why don't you confirm whether this baby will start, huh? <laughs> Let me guess. Working. That guy can fix it. Try it again. Hey, you gotta stop, stop, hey. stop, stop. Stop, stop, stop. 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 Oh, you're gonna tear up the star. Uh -oh. Oh, yeah, that would have been your face. Oh, Jesus. Ah! Ah! Stop. <laughs> okay, well. Hey, 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 keep up, keep up, keep up. Okay, so. I get that they have to walk, but why do they leave the road? Lives in <laughs> Illinois, correct? <laughs> well, why are y'all going so hiking? I'm walking to Illinois. I figure we'll get there by like Friday evening. I hope that works in the schedule. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Joyce. We're not walking to Illinois, okay? Okay, well, then what are we doing? I don't know. <laughs> Just saying. Ah! <laughs> what? <sighs> L, 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 yeah. I was about to say, he looks so calm. I found him. Where is he? Woods. Woods? It's with Will's mom. My, my mom? <laughs> what are they doing? <laughs> Illinois. They're going to Illinois. Um, Not now, mom! Illinois, like the state? That's where her state sister's at. Illinois. Does it still hurt? Only when I talk. Well, it's a good thing you're not Mike then. <laughs> we burn the shit out of him and make sure he doesn't escape this time. Okay, then what? Then we win. No, see, that's <laughs> the problem. We got the mind flare out of Will before and he just came right back. How in the hell did we do that? I don't know. Maybe L does. What are they still doing in there? I don't know. Girls just like <laughs> hanging out in bathrooms. Why? I don't know. They're conspiring. I was like Lucas that's when I was a kid. <laughs> just eating out the cereal box. My main. But I thought it was already over. It's not over, okay? We're just taking a break. She said she dumped your ass. That doesn't sound like a break. <laughs> it wasn't. You guys do realize we can still hear everything you're saying, right? <laughs> <laughs> conspiring. I told you. They're conspiring. Mike, open the door. Uh oh. You know, adding um, Max to the show, like, just really balanced the show perfectly. They needed her a lot. They will torture and kill us. Hey! You gotta take it easy on that thing, okay? You're gonna drain the battery. What do you think, Petey the mall cop is gonna rappel down here and save the day? All right, why are you such a cranky pants after getting to spend the night with Rob? Shh! While you children were sleeping. <laughs> what are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? I'm taking a leak. Look away. Oh, it got in there. Can you oh. your stream, please? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, Kevin! Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't even know what that is. Exactly. It could be useful. Useful? <laughs> How? We can survive down here a long time without food. But if the human body doesn't get water, it will die. No, don't I drink that. Tubes, but this is not water. Or dying of thirst? I drink. <laughs> I mean, I agree with her, but she's got to give us some more time. <laughs> At least two more days. <laughs> We've got company. The first cyber drug. <laughs> Bruh. I was about to say, they better be hiding. <laughs> that is so underground. They're going to notice one's missing? Or no? I don't know. They didn't even care. It smelled like pee. Let's go. 
He's lucky. My luck, that would have blew up in my face and blinded me. Or turned me into the whole thing. It would have said, see you on the other side, brother. <laughs> yeah, it would have. Or is that what he says on Lost? Mm -hmm. Another life, brother. Yeah, there you go. Like that. Jesus Christ. <gasps> you still want to drink that? That would feel like hell, right? <laughs> like the back rooms. Yeah. That'd be scary. Cause you'd be on? halfway through and they'd come and you'd be like, oh, I'm in a pickle. It was the same thing, the exact same thing that happened to Will last year. And look at this. Well, I'm here now, aren't I? Hallelujah. <laughs> if there are two, we have to assume there are more. Heather. Mm. Billy was doing something to her. She was screaming. <laughs> Screams. What's a good scream? Max said, doesn't matter. <laughs> Who is Heather? She's a lifeguard at the pool. Heather Holloway? Tom. Crazy. I love when they communicate. Seriously? Welcome to my world. Nancy sort of looks like she's always See, headed to Sears. Are we going Nancy Sears? <laughs> she looks like she needs to go by. Uh oh. The tracks. In Russia, we track bears for six days with no food. <laughs> you know, walking so close to me, you stink. I get it, I get it. You're upset, right? Because I uh, blew up the car? Yeah, with me in it. Your new boyfriend, right? Yes, <laughs> every man I talk to from now on has to be my boyfriend. Yeah, he does. You're right. a little bit of a Russian Scott Clark. Oh, here we go. Maybe you should go on a date. I don't know, I'm thinking like Enzo. He's running. <laughs> Son of a bitch, get back here! Come here! Smatri! Smatri! I thought I was gonna see a waterfall for some reason. Those hats are kind of tough back there, though. Uh, he's never been to one, it looks like, right? Mm -mm. <laughs> you all gonna pay for those? Yeah, Ricky, we got you. <laughs> So they made it to Illinois? Uh, baby, I don't think so. I think they're in Hawkins or something. Yeah, but he had an Illinois you, map. Kind of oh, hunter? am I wrong? I'm a cop. I'm undercover. They must be right on the line then. You just keep your mouth shut, all right? All right, all right. Hop in. Come on, get in. Hey! Hey! hey. You hey! You hey! This is a police <laughs> emergency, all right? I need to commandeer your vehicle. What is, there's a what is your name, sir? Todd. Todd? Yeah, Todd. <laughs> Murdered many children. What? Hey, what's going on? Ah, Detective Byers. Uh, <laughs> this is Todd. <laughs> the promotion she needs. Lend Look us his vehicle to transport our dangerous criminal. Uh, child murderer. Child murderer. We should really get going. Hey, how do I get my car back? You just call the station. What station? <laughs> it said Todd father. <laughs> what? Dude! He got straight up robbed. <laughs> He got robbed by admit, Agent Scully and Agent Motor. This is impressive. There's no stairs, there's no exit. There's just an elevator that drops you halfway to hell. They're commies. You don't pay people, they cut corners. It's gotta be much more valuable, like Promethean or something. What the hell is Promethean? It's what Victor Stone's dad used to make cyborgs, bionic, and cybernetic components. You're hmm. all so nerdy, it makes me physically ill. No, 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 <laughs> no. Don't lump me in with them, I'm not a nerd, all right? Prometheus is a Greek mythological figure, but whatever. All I'm saying is, <laughs> it's probably being used to make something. Why here? I mean, Hawkins, seriously, of all places. I That's what I think, best. too. Or a toilet stop on your way to Disneyland. But because it's so it. isolated out there, right? know about that. They could. So it's connected, maybe. How? I don't know, but it's possible. I'm sorry, is there something you two would like to share with the class? Nope. Yeah. Easily beats us the Russian. It's the code. Wherever that broadcast is coming from. It's close. It can reach the surface. Let's go. Smart. That would be stressful to answer the door with all of them. I was just about to say, I don't know if I'd answer. <laughs> Is this one of them cults? That happens in our neighborhood. They walk up. Can we come in? Tom? Heather? Jesus, it's freezing. Oh my goodness. Do you guys smell that? Oh, God. More chemicals. That's so scary. <laughs> That's so creepy. You think they're guzzling this shit? Yeah, you know that, but they just went on a hell of a cleaning spree. Mm -mm. This is something new. Mr. Clark, fifth grade, pause it. What happens when you mix chemicals together? This house is creepy. It's the music, I think. Oof. What? Yesterday, Tom had a bandage on his forehead. And he was sweating so much. Yeah, he, he got smacked. Call 911! sister school she kept saying i have to go back what if the fleeing it's taking place somewhere else 
There must be a place where all this started, right? A source. Somewhere he didn't want me to see. Um, How do we find it? Mrs. Driscoll. If she wants to go back so badly, why don't we let her? Yeah, good thinking, Will. I'm just pumping gas over here. Hey, whoa! Don't cross me right now! <laughs> <laughs> well, now he's tough all of a sudden, He's huh? the Todd father, don't forget it. What else did you say, this psycho? No offense, but I already went over all this with the cops. I'm not a cop. Yeah, no shit. They say that in every single show. <laughs> I already talked about it with the cops. <laughs> don't look at them. Tell me about this psycho. What a day for Ricky. Yeah, if Ricky didn't have such a smart mouth, though. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Look at the camera. The camera above you to the right. <laughs> oh, the lawyer. Identify yourselves. Jim Hopper, Joyce Byers, Smirnoff. Alexi. Alexi. Surname. I don't know. Family name. Yeah, I know. I, to I don't know, okay? Jim, open the damn door. <laughs> it's a little bit eccentric, but completely harmless. <gasps> oh. <laughs> <Dang>. <laughs> <laughs> Murray, that's his name. All right, relax. Nobody saw. <laughs> oh, what is that? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> it almost looks like damn Comic Con down there, don't it? Oh, Jesus. Red Dawn. I saw it. What about the West? So what? The the Red Dawn. Room. You saw the comms room? Correct. Are you sure? What is happening? We're gonna move fast. We're gonna stay low, okay? Move it! Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Pizza Stroshnam. Pizza Stroshnam. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 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 she tried. She used everything she knew. Steve thinks he wants to go oh, for what? Four at this point or something? Got him. Want to fight. Dude! You did it! <laughs> you want to fight! Yes. The one that counted. I guess a Russian soldier. That makes sense. <laughs> That's the one that mattered. What are he you can't beat up old. Start to get out of here. <laughs> Who wants to walk <laughs> all the way dude. back? Is way better. If I knew she could knock out a Russian, that would have been our plan in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you're Guys, there's something up there. Oh, shoot. This tunnel's obviously leading under Hawkins' lab, right? Holy shit. I think so. I mean, that's the only thing that makes sense. I mean, I thought it was been kind of obvious. I was actually, I didn't want to say it because I thought the show had already said it. That's how they're. Oh. Yeah, that's how they're powering it, huh? What is it, like, damn plutonium or something? He said it, Promethium. So they've been chipping away at this. They have to keep brief. Oh, wow. So L is super powerful. That's all you need yeah. to know to know about L. <laughs> they've been doing this so long, they built a whole tunnel system. See, you're the only one who gonna tell you. Whoa, 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 excuse me. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? I was just going to visit my grandma again. This is my family. Extended. <laughs> I don't care who they are. You know the rules. Two visitors at a time. Yeah. Uh, two. <laughs> that was realistic. Yeah. That was... I just look forward to you never doubting me again. <laughs> well, they fixed that. Yeah, because he was humble and apologized. Good, good on him. Come on, yeah, you piece on. of shit. <laughs> L. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. I think that was it. That was what? The olive branch. <laughs> what? The piece of ring. Oh my God. You're helpless. Okay. I'll distract Max. She obviously wants you to. She's just standing there. Right. Reading better homes. <laughs> I didn't pick up on that. I'm kind of like Mike. <laughs> oh. Where is she? I don't know. Are you sure this is the right room? Yeah. She's gone home. Oh, shoot. Is this a dream? We were hoping it might come back. Who's no, this is that? real life. We're fired, remember? He's making you do this. Good response from Jonathan. Oh, no. Go, go, go! What do we call those? The ultimate D-bags at work? Hey. Hi. Does your species like M&Ms? <laughs> They love them. They absolutely love them. I like them. the new look, by the way. It's cool. Thanks. 
I'm glad everyone's rekindling before this um, <laughs> fight right here. <laughs> Oh, shoot. Now, I don't want her in my damn house. Come on, pick up! <laughs> oh, my gosh. Hi there. No, <laughs> this is so scary. They could really use 11 right now. For you, Nancy Drew. You'll be great on our army. Mm. Oh, no! Dang, did he just headbutt him? Oh, he's going WWE. Not the chair, not the chair! <laughs> No! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Ooh. Dang, she's out here disconnecting spinal columns almost. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh, my gosh. oh good thing he tossed her name. Oh my god. Nancy! Don't they need it to report elsewhere so it can stop chasing him? Oh my god. This ain't no time to sit on the stool, Jonathan. Oh, oh not Tom. Where are you going? Well, they have to take them somewhere, technically, right? Mm -hmm. To get flayed, so they can't flay them right there, thank God. Right? I think they're gonna get took. I see you, Mr. Scary Killer. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm in the house. You guys know what I'm talking about. You who? Nancy Drew, where are you? No. <gasps> they're like half zombies, which makes it creepier than zombies. Nancy. Because they're still a little human. Yeah. Zombies are at least like that. <laughs> are you kidding? Marco. Oh, that hurt him. Oh, yeah, because they're like connected. connected. Yeah. Him again. It is reminding me of Last of Us in, in that way. Now Jonathan's going to finish him. Go to <laughs> Dang. It's going to look like they got fired and needed revenge. I was about to say, we would feel sorry for that guy, but we're not allowed to because he was so mean to everybody. So I guess he deserved to get his throat cut and possessed. But hey. It's kind of going down because what are you going to say about this hospital stuff? I know this is another incident in Hawkins. They can't keep hiding it, huh? Yeah. Are they regenerating like Wolverine? Mm, the opposite. Like the rats were doing that thing. What, in the hemoglobin? Burn it. I guess at this point, you don't really want to mess with it too much, huh? Yeah, because if you, like, step in it, you know? It'd be like the blob who ate everything. That Goosebumps book. Oh, no. Man, we got problems in Hawkins, everybody. No, you're not covering that one up. Insane episode. These things just combine like terms and became a larger unit. And that thing looked absolutely crazy. It looked like the, uh, it kind of looked like that Pokemon. What's the one that's muck. like slimy? Yeah, like muck or something like yeah. that. Yeah. Right. It's funny how I mentioned Pokemon at the beginning of this episode and then we saw a damn Pokemon at the end. Right. But babe, what do you think about this episode? I think that we're kind of figuring out a little more about what's going on, but we still also are, don't know what's going on more. We're learning more, but we're also getting right. more questions. Because the, the Russians, are a big mystery to me because I'm I know they're trying to get in but the stuff that's happening out there I'm wondering do they even know that that's happening right because it seems like they'd be having some sort of control on it if they did but right it's seeming like that's an accident yeah, yeah I don't think they're aware of that I do think that they're probably surveilling the town a lot more than we realize right and hopefully they are because I think that'd make the story better but mm -hmm. um obviously that town coming under the mall or that tunnel under the mall is going to Hawkins 
Mm. Right. I honestly. think so. Because that's well, where, well, yeah, because that's where L was the first time. Unless they rebuilt it in a different place. Right. But I'm pretty sure it was Hawkins because they have all the infrastructure there. I don't and, think And that for we some saw reason, that, exactly. that guy was there to beat up Popper. So he was mm. there protecting something. Yeah. I don't know. So they adopted them a, a new, I guess, a Russian companion. So Alexi. He's along for the ride. I guess he's sort of like Jamie Lannister and Brienne of Tarth. Yeah. Uh, they do <laughs> maybe that in he a becomes couple their movies. friend. You think so? You think I learned some English? <laughs> maybe, maybe he can be on the police force now. The Russian police, yeah, <laughs> uh, to deal with. Maybe they need to hire a Russian on the Russian police force to deal with all the Russian crime going yeah. on. Yeah, um, I, I, this show's just going crazy right now, man. It's we didn't get a lot of Billy in this one, but we know what he's doing. Uh, we have a different species, obviously. So we have demigorgons, and then we have like the flayed, and then we have the mind flayer, and then we have whatever this thing was, which was its own entity. It was. It well, it seemed like well, it was the flayed. That was like the flayed, but I feel like yeah, I don't know. I you get what I'm saying. We just need to learn more about it, man, because... I don't even have like something to think about that. I mean, other than the fact that, you know, when they got it out of Will, that kind of looked like they were getting it out of that thing. They got it out of them, but they took them with it. So I don't know. Right. You've never heard that? <laughs> Simple literature, me dear. <laughs> That's probably the name of the thing. Oh, shoot. It's going down everywhere. <laughs> that is not where you want to go. <laughs> I'm not even going to say it. I won't forget you. Oh, no. Damn. That part was literally, guys, that was insane. Dustin thinks he's losing his hero, for real. <laughs> the sacrifice. Oh my gosh. He said, I won't forget you, <laughs> Steve freaking Harrison. He's here. Oh my gosh. Oh, <laughs> oh my God, run, Jonathan, run. Oh my God. Oh my God, dude, no, 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 no. What is that? What is that? That's the door you want right there. Can it, yeah, I was wondering, could it like sludge down? Okay, well I'd wait for it to come on this side and I'd just run right back out. Cause it takes it a minute. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. What you gonna do, John? Oh my god. She's gotta be dead, right? Oh, she's tough. Oh my gosh. Is that the mind player? It's just like a piece of it or something. She just comes in and gets a word. You saw that? <laughs> hey, but Jonathan's the goat, though, dude. He was. He, Jonathan would have jumped in there. Yeah, he really was trying. I give Jonathan the most jump, but I love Jonathan. I think it's because he's one of my favorite characters. Are you okay? Good job, Are love. you okay? Now it's just outside, though. In the streets, girl. <laughs> oh no. I feel like it's sad right now. Like, it just got beat up. <laughs> Do you think it's like Venom? Yeah, he's like sulking. Chocolate, blood, brains. They look so scary, honestly. Yeah, because he's got on a it's white time. beater. It's time. Oh, he's about to play some Imagine Dragons. Do you think it talks? Do you think it talks through Billy? I'm, I'd imagine so. I don't think they think it talks. It seemed like it could just yell. No, it, it used to talk through Will. Yeah, so it probably talks through Billy. Yeah, I wonder why they started having a thirst for chemicals. He would be in front of that. My friends in state PD, highway <laughs> patrol, they're all on the lookout. I got like eyes on. He's driving around in a yellow convertible, for Christ's sakes. He sticks out like a sore thumb. Since last time, he got the better of you. Uh -oh. Damn, it's that easy to start that? I, I didn't 
me back. There's a quick lever. I went on one of those recently, and the guy in the middle was vaping and listening to music. He was just like, I was just like, what the hell? Isn't that true? It was wild, dude. I was like, what the hell? Wasn't he playing crazy music? He was like, you have one thing to find this man for me. Not if you understand. Back to the headquarters. Oh, uh, old school BK. Two whoppers, extra ketchup, large fry, and one extra large Slurpee. <laughs> you got high for it. Burger King is nowhere near the 7 Eleven, by the way. Never said it was. center. <laughs> His Slurpee says it's strawberry. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. So what? Pop, he did ask for cherry. <laughs> <laughs> they, didn't cherry. <laughs> they didn't have it. And it doesn't matter because it all tastes the same, okay? <laughs> it is sugar on ice. You tell him that. Tell him what? You tell him that it all tastes the <laughs> goddamn same. Sakhar Sardon, Nikakoy Raznitsi. Kaže tomu pridurku, što eto ni jedno i to же. It's not the same at all, and he would like <laughs> cherry. Oh, yeah. You tell him, he can forget it. Ogavarit abajosje bezvishni. The no info. Andi Sara, I don't like that. He says, no cherry, no deal. Uh-oh. <laughs> he tried, he tried, he tried. Jim's a patient man. <laughs> I'm just giving him an opportunity. <laughs> Not the glasses. I have dealt with assholes like this my entire life. Oh, he's about to go for real. Yeah. I was about to say, why did he do that? in the woods. He could have escaped, but he didn't. <laughs> he stuck with us. <laughs> why do you think that is? Jim. It's because <laughs> he's scared. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's why? <laughs> Not a boss. Now they're gonna get their own guy. Them, that if he runs back to his comrades without a scratch on him, it's gonna <laughs> I know they're gonna hear it. Seconds before he comes knocking on that door, mm. right back into our arms with a new sense of humility. <laughs> oh, but they're gonna get him because uh, you, you know. Yeah, 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 exactly. He started the car. Hopper. <laughs> <laughs> testing us. He's just calling my bluff. He's like, yeah. <laughs> Now he's the top father. Is now driving away. Jim, move. Joyce, move. Joyce, move. <laughs> Was he right? What if he tries to run him over? Is that even a road, though? Yeah, that was a road. I wonder why. Okay, hot. Huh? What did he say? He says he likes strawberry too. <laughs> yeah, but that guy's probably still playing Hopper. He just realized at this point he's a fool, so now he's about to play him some more. Or he's like, Joyce, you can read people, and I could read criminals. <laughs> right. I love how she can't believe Lucas is involved. <laughs> that one stunk. Wow. <laughs> Who do you work for? For the millionth time, I work at Scoops Ahoy! <laughs> Look at my outfit! Look at my outfit! I'm not laughing at you, see you. I'm just laughing at the fact that how the hell did you end up here? Uniform. <laughs> how did you get in? <gasps> I already told you. Uh-oh. Who do you work for? Uh, Scoops Ahoy. <laughs> oh my, no, 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 seriously. That's terrible, man. So Steve's gonna have the biggest character development life in this moment right here. <laughs> what did you do to him? What did you do? <gasps> <gasps> Dang. Uh, uh, Steve, wake up. Steve, what did you do? Uh, you are going to regret that suka. What do you say, Some suka? Who's she trying to find, Billy? Maybe at this point, he's, she's looking for uh, Steve. But she wouldn't know he's missing yet, right? I don't think so. Dustin did the code red, but... Dang. Mike, you need to relax. What if she gets brain damage or something? Oh, shit. <laughs> Maybe they have all the chemicals they need. Maybe they've all turned the pool, into Because the pool, right? Things. Maybe? I found him. Found. 
who? I mean, I am scared that her nosebleed is going to turn into something. So right. I kind of don't want her to use her powers as much as possible. He calls but it the key. And if she wants to do it, she wants to do it. Emits a great energy. They're using it to flee in the acrobat. Now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what this is going to be able to do. Okay, so now imagine what Oh, so no. this door is open now? Пока нет, но он открывается. He says it is opening. They're like, we don't want that. <laughs> Where are you going? To, to call our children. Слушай, а можно посмотреть Луни Тунс? Нет. А ключ можно выключить? Эдисон разве не мог выключить? Of course he could turn it off. Could... <laughs> but what? Ну даже обычный Рэмбо не смог бы туда попасть. He says that even thin Rambo <laughs> couldn't get there. Impossible. Okay, you ain't never seen Hopper work. Right. Jackpot. <laughs> I really don't want them to get caught now, seeing what they did to Steve. How big did you say that Demogorgon was? Big. Nine feet or so. Why? Yeah, was that like a cage? Donna. <laughs> Erica? <laughs> what the hell is that? Hey, that might weapon. work. <laughs> Dustin's about to be driving that around on <laughs> <down> there. <laughs> hey. Stop yelling. Steve. Oh my God. <laughs> well, there's Steve. Uma Thurman's daughter. You can tell. Are you okay? She really does look like her. Right? Mm. I can't really breathe. My eye feels like it's about to pop out of my skull. But... Good news is they're calling you a doctor. <laughs> That's not good news. Do you see that table over there to your right? No, your other right. Oh. Yeah, okay. <laughs> One, two, three. It's got to okay, suck for works. Steve because okay. his head's probably right. pounding. I know. <laughs> One, two, three. Yeah, so they walk in. Oh, man. Worst case scenario. It's okay. It's okay. Don't cry, Robin. <laughs> She's laughing. Are you laughing? I'm going to die in a secret Russian base with Steve the Hare Harrington. It's just <laughs> too trippy, man. No, we're not going to die. We're going to get out of here. Just, you got to let me just think for a second. Do you remember um, Mrs. Click's sophomore history class? <laughs> Mrs. Click Kitty Clackity? That's what us band weeps called her. I sat behind you two days a week for a year. King of Hawkins High himself. Do you even remember me from that class? Aww. You were a real asshole, you know that? Yeah, I know. I was still obsessed with you. What? You know, I wish I had known you in Click's class. Yeah? Really, I do. Maybe you could help me back. I almost <laughs> forgot she was behind him. I would be happily slinging ice cream with some other schmuck. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta say, though, I liked being your schmuck. It was fun while it lasted. Aww. It was. Where were you two going? Oh, you know, no. maybe he left the scissors to see if they were agents or not. Try agents would have got out. This time, yes. To make your visit with Dr. Zarkov less painful. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. What is that thing? It will help you talk. Did you make that thing? <laughs> that would be my question too, honestly. I guess we're taking some more truth serum. Oh, shoot. Billy's staying in his room on the 4th of July? No, that's not normal. We won't be surprised. We'll know that they're coming, and we will kick their flayed butts. You mean Elle will kick their butts? Fuel up, Elle. We have to find the source. Billy knows it. Billy's been there. To the source. Yeah, but... It's a trap. I know. We can't go to Billy, but I think there's another way. Oh my gosh. Well, he doesn't look even more psychotic than when we first met him, does he? Can you hear me? I want to see what happened. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Something's wrong. What? I feel like this isn't good. Yeah, because Heather was falling somewhere. That's what I'm saying. Like, she's my... Uh, what? Do you know she has no idea where she's at? Elle, Elle, are you okay? I'm okay. What's going on? I'm on a beach. There weren't any beaches in Hawkins. What else do you see? Her mom? A woman. Oh. She's pretty. Yeah, who is that? I think she's looking at me. Oh, is it Billy's mom? Yeah! <laughs> you did it! <laughs> There's a boy. But any longer than that, Dad's gonna be mad, okay? Okay, Billy! Watch out for recurrence! I know. 
It's Billy. It's California. Do you think Billy's mom drowned trying to save him? Is I that what's about to so. happen? Oh man. And that's, that's why, why he's so mean, angry. And that's why he's mean to Max, probably, because like yeah, and that, that was sucks. Yeah, I get that, but you should stop being mean to people. The source. Two minutes, Jim. It's a secure line, but any longer than that, and they could trace you. Yeah, I want them to trace. What? Philadelphia Public Library. This is Jim Hopper, uh, Police Chief Hawkins. <laughs> I got this number from Dr. Sam Owens. What is your identification code? Identification code. You don't know it? You must be joking. Oh, no, I, oh, I got it, I got it. <laughs> I got you it. wrote it down and kept it in your wallet? Antique chariot. Listen, um, tell Owens that the Ruskies are opening the gate. Now he'll know what that means. Not about the Ruskies, but about the gate. <laughs> tell him there's an entrance <laughs> at Star Court Mall. I know how to get in. But I need backup, a lot of backup. Have him call me back here at 618-628-313. Your message will be relayed. So now what? Now we, uh... We wait. We wait. Philadelphia Public Library. Yes, hello. Uh, this is, uh, Antique Chariot's partner. <laughs> Wheelbarrow. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think this chariot properly conveyed the urgency of our situation. What are you doing? You can't just sit around and wait for a call. Ma'am, I'm gonna need you to stay calm. <laughs> patronize me. I don't know who you are, if you're some glorified secretary or what, but if you don't want to lose your job, he's got to get to Hawkins and he's got to bring his men right now. Do you understand me? <laughs> yes, yes, ma'am. Thank you and good day. Nice job, Will Barrow. <laughs> He's looking out for number one. No one cares. <laughs> he has all this top secret stuff. Honestly, I don't really feel anything. You? I mean, I, I feel fine. I feel normal. Yeah, I feel, I feel fine. No secret? What? I like it too. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's like Pulp Fiction. Messed it up. Yeah. <laughs> Moron. Moron. Hey, Moron. Moron. Oh, no. There's definitely something wrong with us. Something's wrong. <laughs> Oh God. <laughs> Would now be oh, a no. good time to tell you that I don't like doctors. Let's try this again. Yes? Mm -hmm. Who do you work for? The scoops. <laughs> scoops <laughs> <away>. <laughs> How did you find us? Totally by accident. I bet you very good. What is that shiny little toy? Oh no. Oh. Hey, see, hey, oh, wait, no, wait, 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 they, they think day. they're definitely military. You think you're so smart, but a couple of kids who scoop ice cream for a living cracked your code in a day, and now people know you're here? Who knows we are here, Suka? Uh, well, Dustin knows. Hey, Steve. <laughs> yeah, Dustin Henderson. Steve! Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Dustin Henderson. No. It's your small curly hair friend. Oh, curly hair, great hair, small, kind of like a How do they know? Yeah. What is he? Oh, he's long gone, you big asshole. <laughs> and he's probably calling Hopper, and Hopper's calling the U.S. Cavalry. Oh, Blaze no. and kick your sorry asses back to Russia. You're going to be two pieces of toast. <laughs> <laughs> Only in the movie, Steve. Is that so? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> No way. <laughs> Dustin, 100%. Yes. Yeah, the whole U.S. cavalry, baby. <laughs> Guns are blazing. Oh my God. Get ready to run. Dustin and Erica. Who would have thought? I know. Why is it blurry? Is it supposed to be like that? I think you gotta move the thing. I saw him again, didn't you? Did you? Wait for me! Get off! What? Are you scared to find me? You scared? This is your new sister. 
Her name's Maxine. Shake her hand. Who's there? I said, her I hand. said who's there? That is so crazy looking, isn't it? I think I found it, Source. Where, El? Where are you? A steel. Rimboard. Steel works. Found it. 6522 Cherry Oak Drive. That's close. El! El, we found it. Get out of there. Get out! Get out. Dang, she got the whole inside scoop then, huh? Where'd they go? Mike? Mike? She better not be in Mike. like a different reality or something. Mike! He can't hear you. <laughs> oh no. You shouldn't have looked for me. Because now I see you. Now we can all see you. Oh my gosh. What are they about to do? Let us in. That day? And now, you are going to have to let us stay. David, where are you going? David! That's so, oh my gosh, that's so creepy. Even that little kid? Man, he's sweating, you see him? All this time, we've been building it for you. <sighs> oh my gosh. All that pain. All of it for you. I don't like that. And now it's time. Time to end it. Did you see him tearing up though? That was strange, right? I guess he's got a lot of pain on the inside. That's what we've been seeing, huh? So they just go there and build that thing up. Holy smoke. That is so sad. Cause I was wondering why it was so small originally. It needs to grow. So they literally, so they did what the rats do. So the rats started this thing. Mm -hmm. They used fertilizer no. to grow them up. Wavy. And it's just cool. And I guess the chemicals are helping to break their bodies down. Oh my God. The mind flare, baby. All right, guys, that was Stranger Things. Babe, what do you think? I thought that was the biggest episode where we found out more about kind of what's happening because we realized it was Elle's fault that all this is happening. Billy threw the Mind Flayer, or the Mind Flayer threw Billy, basically told Elle that they're, the whole hunt is for her. They're going to destroy her and then end the world. Yeah, yeah, they need to definitely get her off the chessboard, man, because she is not going to let them. Uh, she seems all powerful. I mean, she really does seem like she's the ultimate. What is it called? What's that junk that Superman can't come in contact with? Kryptonite? They made a whole song about it. You know what I'm talking about, right? She's oh. a kryptonite to these people. Oh, she's like, oh, uh, like, um, she freedom. She's of the same. It's almost like since she's so psychologically advanced, I don't really know how to describe her condition. Right. She's just able to really put them in rap. So. I don't know, man. So crazy, because of her episode. power, she let them into the world, and now they said they're not going to stop, basically. They said, now you let us in, you got to let us stay. Yeah. They got squatters rights. <laughs> basically. 100%. To me, that's really sad for Elle, because I feel like that's going to give her a big burden, because, you know, she's really... <laughs> yeah, she brought on the apocalypse. <laughs> right, but, you know, she has relationships, and, like, Mike, obviously, he's very protective of her, so... I feel like at some point, Eleven's going to have to sacrifice herself or something. Well, I feel like if she keeps messing around and making her nose bleed, I mean, she's going to have an aneurysm eventually. I thought right. it was really funny in the episode when Mike's like, she's going to get brain damage. And then Lu Lucas is like, wait, that's the thing or something like that. Because it's just funny. They're just pointing out the fact that back then they didn't know as much about like CTE and stuff. It's kind of right. like a shot at like the NFL and stuff in a way. So that part was kind of funny. Yeah. Um, yeah, 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 it was actually. Yeah. I think they knew a lot more than they let on though. I think that was the point. Right. And they just hit it a lot or something. I'm not really sure. I don't know anything about it. I don't really have an opinion on it, but it's a crazy episode. And I, these think people, the, I think that's the point of showing her nosebleed though, is that it's eventually. It's decay in her brain. It yeah, takes a toll on her. Eventually something's going to affect her because of it. Right. I feel like I wouldn't be surprised if in the end she did pass away and everyone was um, sad and missed her. But she passed away because you can't just be, you know, that powerful and that psychic your whole life. And without it taking a toll on your brain, I guess, you know. Right. Well, um, the, well, basically, I think there at some point there will be consequences between like the the travel. 
traveling back and forth through those things well yeah because there's, there's a lot of like at some point because they're they're making it known that she's going in there too much yeah yeah well there's a lot going on with your like consciousness right it's mm -hmm. an electrical field in your head it's very weird so when you're traveling in and out of dimensions and you're going to like one reality to another like i'm sure it takes this effect you know right i mean we see it we've seen it in the spider-man thing if you're going to a different universe you glitch out so well, you certain... can't even go under the water like if you go scuba diving right you can't just swim to the top you'll die you'll right. explode on the inside you have to come up slowly and get your body used to it so i think the same thing's going on there i think mike's in the right for wanting to look out for l's best interest because a lot of people well, the problem is they're all kids at the end of the day. So none of them are technically able to consent to anything because they're not smart enough. Right. Mm. And so she doesn't realize, you know, like sometimes you need people to help you keep you from harming yourself, I guess. So Mike's doing his best, but it's just one of those things, man. She's going to do what she's going to do. Right. But I feel and bad. She's I'm been constantly she's gonna... known as a weapon like her whole life. Yeah, since Papa. exactly. Yeah. So yeah. It's good for someone to have her like, you know, her well, and Hopper, him and Hopper are kind of on the same page with that. Ideally. And I don't, I'm not sure how much Mike wants her to use it doesn't want her to use it i'd have to go back and watch the whole series to really think about that but it seems like the idea should be you should use her as the least amount as possible yeah but like max on the other hand is like you you do it girl you do it as much as you want actually do it more like prove them wrong just well don't. i feel like it's just because she wants to Elle wants to do it because she well Elle it's feels also Elle's responsible, responsible for this whole thing. I know, yeah. yeah it's just sad because she's gonna end up hurting herself as yeah well, I'm trying to say, yeah so. that's that's just what it the kind of we see coming and that's the sad part because i just feel like either that's gonna come i feel like maybe she's been going in and out and that actually makes her like able to be on the same par so maybe they could fight her because mm -hmm. i feel like genuinely like she's, she's weaker so they, i feel like it's weakening her so they have like you know almost level playing field because mm -hmm. i feel like she is that strong well right when she closed the gate she took a big break yeah you notice that remember so maybe you're onto something there for sure the russians beat the hell out of steve uh robin and steve both actually got beat up pretty bad and the chairs fall over and robin's great because instead of crying about it or freaking out she laughs about it and that's not easy to do but she looked death in the face and laughed about it i think right. steve likes that what do you think? right i think steve had a big moment there because she was like you were so cool you had the world la 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 and he's like yeah but here i still am like you see how great that is right yeah and basically he had like a i don't know it was a humbling moment i guess for him along with because you know he's still been on his little run of trying to get girls not succeeding so i feel like now he'll just embrace his nerdiness with everybody else i guess like the cooler you are the you know your self-awareness completely goes out the window so steve just had no idea how he was coming across to people when he was yeah. trying to impress everyone and that's usually true like in real life dustin was hilarious in this i thought dustin and um erica erica was the funniest they were a great duo yeah show. they were <laughs> hilarious great. yeah i love the whole under the elevator scene i just thought all of that was really cool it was really mm -hmm. interesting but I that part's the see. most confusing part to me right now because Is I, it really? yeah because i get you know i get the russians are there because the alexi kind of said why they're there because they're trying to open the thing right but the part that's confusing to me is that they don't know about all this extra stuff and that's why i'm confused how that's gonna tie in with the other well, they don't have the whole town okay so this is what's going on with that so the russians basically came in and they got political they realized this place happens to have a corrupt mayor maybe the reason they have a corrupt mayor is because of the russians i don't know but the russians come in they infiltrate the mayor obviously the mayor is indebted to him that's why he had to go put on a show well no him. alexi said it was the the location it was wrong when they were doing it in russia the location is right. the other right equation. and so the russians came here and that's why that's working out and so obviously they're doing their business that's why they put in the mall and all that but the reason they're doing it there is because like if you get into the you know what i'm saying the freaky deaky and all that there's this there's something called like ley lines or something think about it like the bermuda triangle you know how the bermuda triangle is like a pocket yeah you know where there's like where energy because of like the magnetic field and all it's that. just because it's there hawkins like it just, just happens to be that location really so that's the whole point is like it wasn't because the lab was there and brenner was like there the doing lab the mind was, control stuff well the whole thing was like you know the pyramids they didn't just go build the pyramids and then align the stars they built the pyramids to align it to yeah, the stars okay. the same way they built hawkins lab they built so they did it, it based because of what was going on like the energy and all that because crap. it's like a natural pocket of, I, I don't know exactly the scientific whatever they're trying to sh prove or show or not prove but whatever they're trying to portray i don't exactly know but maybe I, I guess with that's the, the idea, right? electromagnetic field was how they kind of were saying like right that particular yeah i got you right like in certain areas of the world like the energy and they different. just ha it just happens to be under a little town of hawkins uh, hawkins indiana yeah. it's not like they strategically placed it there but i could be wrong maybe they did 
Right. Or maybe they strategically placed it there to originally do an experiment, and that's where everything happened originally. And it all kind of and like it all went, went from, from there. there. So I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, we'll <laughs> see. So I don't know if it's like a natural phenomenon, if it has anything to do with just like natural natural processes, and that's why the experiment is uh, highly like highly successful there, or if it just has something to do with that's just where they chose because it is such a small town, you know. Mm-hmm. So just to reiterate. So right. we really need to see about that. But the implications of that is going to really point us in the direction of what the show is truly going to be about. Because if yeah. the whole United States government's involved and all that, then it's a whole different show. Right. If it's just Russians at Hawkins, you know. I feel like this situation, the hospital situation and all that's happening right now in the show, they're not going to be able to cover it up anymore. Like they're going to not have at this point. No, especially when people are going to go missing. Like you have like that, that lady, Dave or whatever. She was like, Dave, where are you going? He's going to be dead. Like, yeah, they all just walk off. No yeah. Trace of them. Yeah. No trace of them. So that's going to put them under the radar. If they do come out of this, I know you're going to be talking about Hawkins in the same breath as Roanoke. Right. You know, and you're not, and you're not going to be able to just like, sign disclosures anymore maybe look at your head look at at your hair (laughs) sorry guys my girl's been at hawkins (laughs) shut up (laughs) look at the little sporadic little hairs you got oh my anyways (laughs) Anyways. sorry sorry i got caught up Ah! oh man stop looking at them well mine's worse but anyways anyways guys this this I, I feel like something it's gonna go down at the mall basically this, something crazy is about to yeah. go down and the mall is located in we go to that mall all the time so when we seen the mall originally I thought damn that's familiar I guess all these malls are starting to look alright guys not really the mall this is the truth we go to Micro Center well we go to that mall too well we go near that mall cause we went to this weird sauna place one time that was like remember have we not been in that mall cause I've been in that mall did we I've lived here my whole life so I've been in that mall yeah oh. we've been in that mall I, didn't, I thought it was closed. Remember, half of it was closed. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Half the stores was closed down. Okay. Yeah, they made it look a lot fancier in the show than yes. it was in real life. That's for sure. So maybe it's just for um, filming. I don't know, because it was half closed. Right. So, yeah, we have been there. We really didn't even notice that in the beginning. but It didn't look. It doesn't look the same. I didn't That's even just think the truth. about it. It doesn't look the same. I'm just really used to stuff like that, because they do film a lot in Georgia. So if they do or don't, then I, it don't really matter to me. I don't even think about it. So. But yeah, we've probably been in that mall. We probably rode past Mike's house. I don't know. Who knows? But amazing episode, man. We really need to get into more. Um, sad seeing Billy's backstory. You should never abuse your kids because obviously they'll come out cuckoo and crazy. But at the same time, man, once you become a grown man, you got to stop that because if not, then at that point, you're not a victim anymore. You're a grown man who's victimizing. Right. Nobody likes you're just putting so. other people in those positions. Well, the whole logic is like, if, if Billy's dad's such an asshole, then like, what if Billy's dad was mean to him? Is Billy's dad not just a victim too? So it's just a weird thing. I, you know, I don't promote bullying of any kind. So the Billy thing's weird. A lot of people in the comments were awfully passionate about that. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. Absolutely. And we'll see you guys on the next one for sure. Peace.